Hey y'all. Oh, I'm looking at the, the time. I'm like, bro, what? It says like two two. Ooh, angel numbers. Anyways. Um, it's 3 a.m. and it's February the second, uh, 2024. Um, obviously I'm gonna be talking about how my day was, meaning technically yesterday, but yeah, let's act like it was today. So today, again, this is a diary entry. I don't know if I said that, but it's a diary entry. I'm just going to be recapping this week and just my day today. So today I went to the recruiter and um, it's not like official, but I am taking steps towards joining the National Guard. Um, I'll basically be enrolling in a program where it's not really a program, but it's like, a, um, it's like a, a system where I'll basically be going into service for a little bit and then I'll be coming back and doing college. And then once I'm done with college, um, I would have like, basically I'm training to become an officer while also going to college so i'll be doing training in the army while also earning money and my college will be free um but yeah y'all it's official so i'm gonna be going for like a month y'all Ugh, like wish me the fuck luck bitch oh my gosh <sighs> wish me luck bro because I feel like I can't not be on social media for like a month. And it's not even about like digesting social media. Like, no, I don't care about the tea, the gossip, none of that. But recording myself and talking about my life is my shit, bro. Like, I like doing it. I get to vent. I get to talk. And it's like, if I can't even do that in the army, like, they're going to be taking away my phone. Like, uh-uh. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. But yeah, like hmm, that's just my biggest concern is like, will I be able to record a video real quick and just be like, hey guys, I'm in the army. <laughs> you know what I mean? So that's like my biggest concern. I mean, guarantee, like, I'm just okay. Here's what I'm scared about. When you are on social media the biggest thing that like determines your success is the algorithm and if you're inconsistent like you're going for like a month it is much higher that you will not be on the algorithm and your videos will not be shown and what's so crazy is specifically on tiktok my friends in college like when i last came to get my stuff from college my friends was like bro You've been popping up on our For You page on TikTok. And I'm like, oh, really? Like, that's what's up. So if I go to the army, I'm like really scared that, I don't know. But I can always run back up. I can always run up, run my, my, my videos back up on the algorithm. I'm not worried, too worried about that. But it is like a concern for me. And then with this YouTube thing, like I'm finally getting consistent. Albeit, is it because I have nothing else to do? Yes. But either way, like, I'm consistent, so that's just, like, what I'm really worried about. Now, that's not even the tea that I really came to tell y'all. Like, y'all already know I'm going to the Army. It's just official that I will be going into the National Guard. That's still the Army. I thought the National Guard and the Army was, like, two different things. I thought the National Guard was just, like, a separate program. But thank God, because... I thought I was going to have to enroll into the army to get the, the work study program, basically, where I still go to school and I train child. And I was super happy while talking to the recruiter, too, because he was saying things and it was just like confirming like things that I didn't want to do. Like he said that he doesn't recommend me go full time. And I was like, thank the Lord. I don't want to go full time. I want to finish school. You know, the army is really just for the opportunity and the experience. That's it. I don't really, like, it's not my passion. You know what I mean? Who knows? It might be, but in my soul, intuitively, what I feel is not my passion. I'm going there for the opportunity. But, 
Yeah, that's not the real tea, y'all. The real tea is that two days ago, y'all. Actually, yeah, I think it was two days ago. Two days ago, my video is blowing up on TikTok. I don't even want to say blue because it is still blowing up. My video is blowing up on TikTok now. If y'all don't have me on TikTok, my TikTok is my full name, Soraya, S-Y-R-I-A-H, Danbrville, D-A-M-B-R-E-V-I-L-L-L-E. -L 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 -E. Um, and I made a video about the whole Krishan and Blueface incident and how I basically... I basically predicted that her tattoo was fake. I was just like, look, as somebody who just got a tattoo last year, it looked fake as hell. And it's blew up. And I'm talking about, I didn't promote it. I didn't pay money for it to blow up. Like, it just blew up. I'm talking about, it's touching hundred thousands. Like, 200,000. I think it's at, like, 200,000. Let me go check that in. Yo, it is at 297K. 297K. That is about to, it's about to touch three. And it keeps growing every day. And I'm, like. I don't know, y'all. Like, I'm just like, and my other videos, they doing, they doing, they blowing up too. But like, that is that video was, like, like that video made my other videos blow up. So that video was like, and yeah. But go check that out. Um, I got a lot of mixed reviews, which that's just like the internet for you. I really don't care. Like, yeah, there was people getting negative in the comments. Like, it honestly just reminds me of when my video blew up on here. Um, my blazing excuse me my Blasian video blew up on here and um I felt like that was like a preparation for what's to come because even that video like I would say 80% agreed with me and then like 20% didn't agree with me and they were getting disrespectful but um I just feel like this is my life path like it's to speak and be heard like you know sometimes and i'm gonna be honest with you sometimes when i'm on youtube it feels like i'm talking into a void you know what i mean like i'm i'm spitting some real shit but nobody's listening you feel me um i'm giving real fucking it let me stop cursing i'm giving real advice and nobody's really listening and i felt that way my entire life um i feel like i've always had an issue with my throat chakra basically like speaking out um and sp uh literally voicing my opinions speaking out for myself i forgot what do you call that thing like yeah just speaking speaking for myself i've always had an issue with speaking and just feeling heard sometimes i feel like when i speak people always purposefully at times misinterpret me or just try not to understand me but like this is what I want to do. Like I said, the army, that's that's the that's a backup plan. That's just to help me out. This is what I want to do. On some real, like I have a real purpose. It's not for the money. It's not for the fame. It's not for none of that. I don't even got to be famous. I just, I want to be heard. You know what I mean? I want people to listen to what I have to say because I have some real shit to say. Like I said, for those who watch my video with an open mind and try to not to be biased, you will understand what I'm saying. But for those who want to be biased and they don't want to hear me, then you're just not going to hear me. You know what I mean? If it's going through one ear and out the other, that's that's that. I'm not going to try to force you to do nothing. Like, I, that's just not me. If you don't want to listen, you don't want to listen. But, y'all, like, the video is going viral. Like, that's what I mean. It's not just blowing up, baby. It's going viral. Literally, I was at 200 followers on there. I was like at 230 something followers on TikTok, y'all. That jumped up to 590 80 followers and it's growing. Like this is just day 2. That 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 number came from day 2 of my video blowing up. Crazy. Literally I was at 2 and I remember I remember like a week ago looking at my TikTok like damn I'm still at 200 like and I'm uploading videos not every day but like I'm a little consistent you know what I'm saying and I'm just like I'm still at 200 boom 500 followers you guys 
just for speaking the truth and voicing my opinions and what I think using my intuition. You know what I mean? Like I said, I don't gotta, I'm not like these other, okay? I'm not like these other girlies. I don't gotta pull out tarot cards all the time and do none of that. I can just read a situation using my intellect, using my third eye, using my gift that the universe and my ancestors and God gave me, which is my sixth sense. So... I mean, who knows? Like, I'm definitely sure that more of my videos will blow up, but this is just the beginning, y'all. Go check out my TikTok so you can see what I'm talking about. I'm not lying. I'm not capping, y'all. Currently, my Instagram, and I don't even pay attention to followers like that. It's just I noticed, like, damn, I'm still at 200. And I've had that TikTok for a while, like, since 2021. I've had that TikTok for a while, actually 2020. Ever since I got to high school, basically. Um, but my Instagram is at 300 followers. This YouTube here is at like 500. It's been stuck. It got to 500 because of the Blasian video. I want y'all to know that. Like, I was like, it's so crazy because I remember I was like at 20, 50 subscribers on this YouTube. And then, boom, 500 because of the Blasian video. It's a blessing. and. Now I'm at 500 on TikTok. My goal for both of my TikTok and my YouTube is to make it to 1,000. That's when you start getting monetized and people actually start to, you know, give a, give a damn. And so that's just basically what I'm trying to do. That's my goal um, to make it to 1,000. I'm just at the halfway point and we're going to keep it going. You know what I mean? It's a blessing for real. You know, a lot of these people on the internet, and I'm not going to lie, sometimes I'll be looking at my counterparts on social media and i'm like wow that's crazy people really just be blowing up just for looking pretty just for coming on the internet looking pretty um you know doing silly things not really contributing to anything helpful and here i am using my voice to spread the word and spread knowledge and i just you know sometimes it feels like i'm pouring but I'm not getting the fruit of my labor. It feels like I'm watering my plants, but I don't see them growing. And y'all know I love my plant babies, but I just got them back from college, actually. And let's just say they was dying, <laughs> but I'm gonna revive them. I'm gonna revive them. But yeah, it's like when you watering your plants and you don't see it growing. That's what it feel like. But this just lets me know that I am being heard. Um, and if it takes for me to talk about celebrities for people to realize that, then shoot. You know what I mean? Because I hate when people be like, oh, why do you care so much? Why do you care so much? I, I don't really care. I don't care about celebrities. I care about how they affect the masses. That's number one. Number two, if y'all peep, I do talk about celebrities every now and then because, and I'm just being completely transparent, when you do talk about celebrities, you get more views and that's just to help people look at my channel like okay she talking about this i agree with her let me see what else she got to offer that's it i don't care about celebrities lives and gossips i care about how they affect the people and i care about how it affects the algorithm in my channel that's it <laughs> that is it y'all peep like i said peep whenever i talk about celebrities uh, my channel blow up But, um, yeah, I'm just super thankful. You know, the ancestors are really looking out for me. Um, man, praise the ancestors for real. Cause I mean, I was uploading videos and I remember it was one video. I really wanted it to be seen, but like for some reason, bro, like it was so difficult to put it out. Like it went against the violation and I even got a strike on my TikTok for that video and it was like I didn't even do anything like yeah I cursed but like everybody curses on TikTok like I got a violation and a strike child but I see everything happens for a reason and yeah I'm super tired so I'm about to hit the hay I hope y'all had a good day. Comment down how y'all feeling mentally. Mentally, I'm feeling like I'm getting back into the swing things. I'm not going to lie. I was going through a deep depression where I just felt like 
my life isn't getting better, you know, um, like not being able to go to college, but my peers are, I'm on, I'm trying to do my thing on social media for real, for real. And I'm not getting the fruits of my labor, but I'm seeing other people blow up for BS. And okay, let me not, let me not sh on other people like that, but I just feel like I have a purpose. Like I actually have a reason to be here. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. But yeah, this just put more, this just gave me more ammunition and more energy. And I'm ready. I'm ready to keep trying. So support me by following. Man, I don't even say follow or subscribe. Like, but I feel like I I might need to. Okay. Subscribe to the channel, follow on my socials, um, my full name. Yeah, I be putting my government out there. I don't care. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Comment down how y'all doing mentally. Peace.